You're looking at a 2016 Jayco J Flight 28 BHBE fully loaded travel trailer. Starting off with the equalizer weight distribution hitch, which is rated for up to 12,000 pounds. The electric tongue jack is equipped with LED lighting, which helps with hooking up in the dark. Next, we have dual 12 volt house batteries, which are wired in parallel with shutoff switches and is convenient if you are dry camping. You have ample basement storage. You have your manual jack and stabilizer tools. This is a view from the other side of the basement storage with a convenient LED light. This is where we store our full-size grill, ladder, chairs, umbrella, and a plastic tub. And moving on, you have your full slide out for your couch and U-shaped dinette. The trailer is equipped with 15 inch tires with the Moride suspension. You have more storage here, which is located underneath the bathroom and shower area. This is where we store our barbecue tools, hoses, and other miscellaneous tools. This is the back of the six gallon water heater and you have your cable coax hookup. We're also including a backup camera that has a GPS style mount for the car that can attach with a suction cup to the windshield and it gives a perfect view of backing in and or a perfect view of your bikes if you choose to use the hitch for your bikes. The trailer is also equipped with an outdoor shower. We also use this as our washing station for dishes and it's also equipped with a solar light which is motion activated. Down here you have your two inch receiver which you can use to attach a bike rack or any other hitch accessory which is rated for up to 300 pounds. This is the second door which is the bathroom entrance and is convenient so you don't have to go through the main entrance to get access. The second bathroom access is essential if you do a lot of beach or dirt camping where there's sand and stuff that kids will track in and out on their socks and shoes while they need to use a restroom or take a shower. Up here you have your 18 foot remote controlled power awning with LED lighting. You also have a couple of outdoor speakers. And let's take a look inside. The inside is equipped with ample LED lighting. This area here we use to store our shoes and sandals. The shoe cubby also has a bench, which makes very convenient sit down area to put your shoes on and off. The digital thermostat controls the fan, AC unit and propane heater.
This is how you raise and lower the TV antenna on the roof. Here is the media center, uh, which we use to store remote controls and other gadgets. More storage underneath the TV. In this pouch, you have all your manuals for all your appliances and electronics. You have your cloth pull-out couch. Storage above the window, which we use for snacks and other pantry items. Jayco includes really nice metal struts in all of the cupboards that um, need to stay lifted up and that makes it very nice so you're not holding up while loading or taking things in or out of the the lift up cupboards all the hinges are very nice hinges the drawer slides are very nice upgraded drawer slides if you compare brands jayco is a step above on those aspects this u-shaped dinette sits up to six people pretty comfortably it also breaks down to a sleeping area. There are plenty of windows in this trailer, which is a big plus for lighting and airflow. The tuck-away ladder is an amazing feature. A lot of rigs don't include a ladder and you have to add a bunk bed ladder. This one tucks away conveniently. It's very sturdy. I am a full-size adult female and I very comfortably can go up and down on that ladder without any fear of it collapsing. So two thumbs up for Jayco for the nice tuck-away ladder. The bunk beds are equipped with Denver teddy bear mattresses. Plugs are everywhere in this rig. Convenient, both bunks have their own two outlet plug. These are super bunks. They're actually over 70 inches. An adult can very easily sleep in these super bunks. A twin sheet is actually too small. You have to use a full size sheet on these bunks. They're so big. Now moving on to the bathroom, which is equipped with a glass shower door with a large size shower, sink and bathroom storage. The Fantastic fans can both suck air out of the rig or blow air into the rig. And if you do it on both of them and leave some windows cracked, you can get a really good flow of air. It makes a really big difference on hot days or to get out steam from either cooking or showering. It uh, really helps with airflow. Under the dinette, we have two custom-built drawers, which we use for pots and pans and for other miscellaneous items. Storage is definitely not lacking in this trailer. You have a eight cubic feet refrigerator which runs on electric or propane with a freezer on top you have a microwave oven and a stove range with an oven Here we have our 15,000 BTU air conditioning unit, which is run by the digital thermostat. You have a skylight, which definitely brightens up the inside. The cupboard above the sink is deep enough for full-size dinner plates, which is nice because a lot of the cupboards in RVs are, you have to tilt up and down paper plates. This one actually fits flat dinner-sized plates. Also, some spice uh, holders around the doors. 
This is where we stored a full-size trash can underneath the sink.